Part 1 Review Let's review the levels of sedation continuum, and care. Minimal sedation, or also known as, awake sedation, used by dentists or treating a patient with anxiety or insomnia, usually implies single drug therapy. Patients respond to verbal commands. The airway, spontaneous ventilation and cardiovascular function are unaffected. Moderate sedation, previously referred to as conscious sedation, is a drug-induced depression of responsiveness during which patients respond purposefully to verbal commands, either alone or accompanied by light, non-painful tactile stimulation. Moderate sedation is the most common level targeted during typical sedation practice in adults. No intervention is required to maintain a patent airway, spontaneous ventilation is adequate, and cardiovascular function is usually maintained. Deep sedation, or analgesia, a patient's responsiveness is significantly impaired by the medication. A purposeful response can be followed after repeated or painful stimulation. Intervention may be required in maintaining a patent airway, and spontaneous ventilation may be inadequate. Cardiovascular function is usually maintained. General anesthesia, patients are completely unarousable, even with painful stimuli. Intervention is often required to maintain a patent airway, spontaneous ventilation is frequently inadequate, and cardiovascular function may be impaired. Sedation is a drug-induced state of depression that produces dose-related therapeutic and adverse effects along the continuum. As the dosage increases, the patient moves towards deep sedation and general anesthesia, and the likelihood of adverse effects increases.